We're all proud, very, very staunchly proud England fans in our own house, you know. Everybody is. Um, I, mean, I remember a few years back when I put St George's flag up in one of my school windows when I was an England fan. It was 2002 World Cup and I put St George's flag outside. So I got mixed responses from nervous colleagues, hence I looked into it, so I realised. It took me quite a while to understand, you know, thinking, well, you know, we all support England, we get behind the team, you know, this is, uh, this is us, you know, they're representing us on the world stage, you know, we want them to do well. If they do well, it reflects good on us. I thought just in keeping in line with the theme for today, St George's Day and England and being English and British and uh, in the current climate where there's a lot of debate and dialogue surrounding, should we say, Britishness or Englishness and what that entails and what that means to certain people and the values that surround a subject such as this. a bit of a hot potato. Um, as someone who indulges in a lot of football poetry, I got the idea from the, um, from the publicity that was going around re regarding this recordio. Hence, I've recorded something myself where I've just put pen to paper. Football is, uh, is probably the only medium I can think of, you know, sport in general, but football itself, where people do actually put their differences aside. You know, people from any nationality, background, from all walks of life, able, disabled, colour, you know, it's, it's a wonderful medium for unity. And we can also learn a lot as well. Apart from actually enjoying a spectacle in itself, a game in itself, there's a lot we can take away from football, we can implement into our lives as well. I am England. <clears throat> Unlike the Shamrock Emerald Isles, plucky Irish folk celebrate. St George stirs doubtful scorn. Racist hero, their nervy debate. I am England. Liberator of stricken damsels, St. George the Dragon Slayer, patron saint of England, more a multinational mayor. I am England, animal guardian in Lithuania, in Beirut a guard, soldier and priest, treasured in Catalonia, cherished in the Middle East. I am England, no barriers, no blockades, cheer England one and all, no dark shadow of racism, in the union of football. I am England. Celebrate the beautiful game, glittering roadshow to enthrall. Football, the sport of the world, belongs equally to us all. I am England. Football leads on unity. I am England rings loud and clear. To play, watch, converse openly. To live free without fear. I am England. Verses rouse the conscience. Puskas to tragic King Lear. Elegy links to England and St. George from the quill of the bard Shakespeare. The game's afoot, follow your spirit, and upon this charge, cry God for Harry, England, and St. George. I am England. Wharton to write Phillips, fulfilled the schoolboy dream. Tis now the point to pen a black English football team. We are England. James Anderson Cole Wright, Campbell Cunningham Rio. You'll never beat Des Walker in Palmer Barnes Default.